wanted to talk about this because it's sad news to hear that uh, Chris Harris has died. Um, I'm not going to say anything negative about him because he's a nice person. I met him at a convention before. Regardless of politics or anything like that, he he is a part of the LBGDQ. He was a very nice person. And the fact that um, I know that his brother, uh, Greg Ayers, is uh, still around. And the fact that it's said that he's going to miss another brother. Um, even his niece, which I'm not going to mention her name, uh, it's said that she will lose a really good uncle who happens to be a, a good man. It said that he passed away. Um, I had the liberty of meeting him at OniCon and other conventions in Texas. And he, he was a very good person. I'm not saying anything negative. I'm not saying anything bad about him. But he was a good person. It's sad that this happened to him. Uh, he didn't die from COVID. He didn't die from any of that stuff. He just died from a very, I think he he had a, a certain condition that caused him to, to uh, die. And I understand his niece kind of talked about this. And I knew, I actually met her niece, his niece, and she was a very nice person. It's, it's sad that this happened. Um... And it's kind of a, a, a sad issue that happened. And even though it, it is really sad to hear the, this story, uh, he will be missed by the anime community as a whole, especially doing the uh, Frieza uh, voice acting. It's going to be, he's going to be remembered. And yes, he's going to be remembered by the anime community. And it's just a shame that he passed away. So anyways, guys, leave your thoughts down below and tell me what you guys think because I have to go. You guys take care and bye-bye.